All right, all right, ladies, gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. I want to see if um, if what I speculated about with the uh, <laughs> with the crossover missions is true. Okay, a fainted encounter. Rumor has it that the Isle of Sky has fallen prey to terrible nightmares plaguing uh, its people. Not a soul on the island. Uh, island can escape. A night of troubled sleep saved the beautiful uh, uh, Isle of Sky from a descent into madness in a fated encounter. Keep an eye out for stra a strange visitor at a raven's store. Okay. Okay, let me just. All right, what's what, what's what's new? What's new? What's this? All oh, right, that's right. I did pre-order the the DLC that's coming up, so I got the Twilight armor. But it gave me a new weapon too. Oh, that. Got that from a Twitch drop. Oh. Oh yeah, there's that. I forgot about that. The axe. Is it is it a Dane axe or a... Let's see. Oh yeah, the community basalm sword thing. Oh it's a Dane axe, it's a two-handed axe. Okay, we'll give it a try later. Yeah, we'll we'll test all this stuff out later. Right? The eye patch for the helmet. Okay, so do I go? <clears throat> do I go to the longhouse? Looks like something is happening near Volker's hut. Perhaps I should take a look. Oh, oh. Okay. What is this? Oh, this is a well. Okay. I can hardly believe it's you. The one fated to save my people. Hello. That woman seems to know me. Can I help you? Oh, it's you. Valka said we would meet, but I can hardly believe the great Eivor is fated to save my little Isle of Sky. Who are you? A hat of yourself, as always, Edith. Eivor, Edith is an old friend and a seer. She contacted me for advice. Her people are plagued by nightmares to the point of madness. I wasn't aware people settled on the Isle of Sky. There are small settlements, but it is a place of passage for many. Making it perfect for dreams to wreak havoc. Until now, I've mostly been deciphering if my cousin's feasting on feathers in her dreams means she should marry a farmer or a baker. <laughs> You've lost me again. Edith needs your help. And it's not just her people being affected. As someone deeply in tune with the spirit realm, I have also begun to lose sleep. I fear it may spread to our settlement soon. I will investigate, but it is not as if I have experience chasing away bad dreams. There is more. You're not going to like this, Eivor, but I believe somehow Ranmi is involved, perhaps even responsible. <laughs> I know Ranvi's whereabouts better than most, and she isn't. Ah, what I mean to say is, she couldn't do something like this. Ever since the nightmare started here, I began asking the spirits for clarity, and the vision came to me. Though it was cloudy, I know what I saw. You will find Ranvi amidst a scene of death on the Isle of Sky. The two of you will fight before you are forced to part ways forever. That just can't be true. Believing is your choice. The only way to find the truth and stop the nightmares from spreading 
is if you go to the Isle of Skye. I must tend to my duties, but Edith can take you when you are ready. So, are you ready? My people can't go without sleep any longer. I need some time before we head out. I'll come back when I'm ready. Please, don't wait too long. My people need you. Alright. Let's see. Because... Because technically... We could just... Technically talk to Randy, right? Because she's here. This is like I know I know for a fact this is the Cassandra crossover. And every but like all goes wrong. Ranvi's here, like always. Okay, so if she comments on it, can Time we talk to her about it? Nope, we there's no option. I should go. people yeah definitely yeah but everybody knows this is a uh, the crossover event I just didn't know when it was coming out that's why I, I didn't stream it today uh, <laughs> excuse me but uh, I do wonder what all the nightmares are about and also people like from the very beginning have kind of talked about how Ranvi and Cassandra look alike can I, uh... You're back. Are you ready to go to Sky now? I'll find out what's plaguing your people. Whatever or whomever it may be. Here we are, sliding on into port, or a dock at least. of sky. Beautiful, isn't it? Any idea why I should go first? Investigate Kilter Aglan first. It's where complaints of nightmares began. My hut is there too, if you need to find me. This is a whole arc? Huh. I mean, it's a brand new location, which I am in love with. But is it? I thought it was just like maybe one or two quests, but no. Let's see. Come on, boy. This might end up being a couple of videos more than, you know, yeah. just the one. Let's see, all the way up there. We can do that. I wonder if we're gonna get any new weapons and armor out of this. Man of store. Come on. 
Look at this thing. Holy shit. Wait, what? Oh, that's an opal. Oh, God. skills. Um. Okay. We got two. Take a look at the map right quick just to see. Ooh. Cause so we only get half of the island, it looks like. Maybe uh maybe two thirds. Some assets clearly need to load in. Go. What? My eyes. I don't need to look around for any. Just ask the villagers about the nightmares. But the evil. Nothing but doom. Nothing but doom. Nothing but doom. Who do I ask? Ildran Coman from Harway Landon. Ah. Hello, sir. We come in old age, sir. Can I talk to him? An eagle. Are you all right? An eagle will bring too. ruin to us all. I saw it in a dream. Can, can I talk to you? Do not much from him. Nope. The nightmares certainly seem bad here. Did I leave the area? Yeah. Um. I don't see anybody else I can talk to. You too? Maybe up here at the long No. Okay, so not him. Or is it just glitched? This is a stable hand. Maybe? <laughs> oh, 
hello. Is everything all right? You seem... Find the warrior woman with the braid. She is our undoing. Stealing our dreams. A warrior with a braid? That can't be Renvi. Where is she? At a church northwest of town. That's all I saw in my dreams. Find her and please <laughs> let me speak. Okay, clearly they're, uh, they're losing it a little bit, so let's go find the warrior with the braid. So what, are we gonna fight Cassandra and then work with her on finding a cure for these dreams? Six hundred and twenty hey. meters out. Pick up truck on the Oh my god. Strange. Vulcan did say her vision was cloudy. Was she seeing Renvi in this aura? In a graveyard, Chorus Vulcan put it. A scene of death. Sandra. And you are? Your opponent. So is this Randvi good with an axe? She is. Much better than you. Ah, I prefer a spear. You favor other weapons too. Where did you get that blade? Talk too much! Ah! <laughs> 
looks like there are some things to talk about. Fine. If we must. So, opponent, do you have a name? Eivor. I take it you're one of the hidden ones. <laughs> Not exactly. But I admire their work. If you're not going to talk straight, let's go back to fighting. I'm not a hidden one, but I have friends that are. And often my goals align with theirs. I assume the same is true for you. Yes. I've made friends with the hidden ones, and I agree with their goals. And perhaps we might have more in common than we thought. You haven't told me why you're here, after coming all the way from... where? I've traveled so much, it's been a long time since I've been from somewhere. But the Greek world was my home, long ago. I came here looking for an ancient artifact that's causing this island a great deal of trouble. You mean the nightmares? A seer told me that the person I'd find amidst death on this island was causing them. The same one that mistook me for someone named Randvi? Maybe your seer is having an off day. You're telling me you're not responsible for all these bodies? I watched these people tear each other apart out of madness and lack of sleep. It's the artifact I'm looking for causing all this. Normally, I'd be quick to track it down, but this fog is making things... difficult. Almost impossible. <laughs> if you're so easily blocked by a curse, how do you expect to deal with the realm of spirits and dreams? A curse? <laughs> you know the secrets of this land well, then. I... Do you hear something? No, no. Listen. Something tells me we should work together. And what exactly is telling you that? The obvious. You want to stop the nightmares, and I want the artifact causing them. Help me get rid of this fog so we can find it. After such a strange encounter, I'm really meant to believe you're not causing the nightmares. I swear to you, I am here to stop them. We can work together. For now. Okay. Well. Oh my god. Well, she technically wasn't old animus protected. So. Found and destroy his cursed symbol to unfog the area. So in here. Hey! Come here! Of course. Here. You're quite strong. You should know. I had you cornered in that fight just moments ago. And an even stronger ego to match. Not surprising. did a number on my health for no reason. What an interesting church. In all my travels, I've never seen one quite like this. Are you here to see the sights or get rid of this fog? I have to take in what I can. It's not as if I plan to stay long. <laughs> All right, Cassandra. Uh, let's see, what? Where exactly? Oh, through here. Here we go. Ah, oh, damn, 
troll magic. Nice work. The curse is fading. It'll be much easier to find the artifact now. Glad I let you tag along to help. I did most of the work. You're getting on my nerves, you know. These close quarters probably aren't helping. No. Let's find a way out. Oh, sorry. I'm still here. Hello. A couple treasures. Yep, yeah, let's get out of here. Oh, looks like we've got some followers. This is just an effect, an effect around everyone. I agree. You're treading on the wrong gods. Not really handling this guy, are you there? Just a demigod that you are. seemed like someone was talking directly to you in the fight. The artifact I'm seeking does cause strange things to occur. But I should track it more easily now that the fog is gone. As if a foreigner could search these hills. Hmm. Ready to commit to being my guide? I didn't say that. If I'm going to help, I need more information, like what exactly is this artifact you're seeking. The less you know about it, the better. The better for you, you mean? You want me to trust you, no? The artifact is an object of great power, left here by old gods. Left on this island, it could wreak havoc on the world. Why aren't we under whatever spell or curse this artifact seems to have placed over everyone else? It is difficult to explain, but artifacts like this can affect people differently. Many are corrupted by them. Perhaps we are of a similar... strength. But even if we're not having nightmares, we should still be wary of its power. If this artifact is ancient and was left here who knows how long ago, why is it suddenly causing problems now? Loki got bored? serious. Truthfully, I'm not sure. These artifacts can be activated. Maybe someone tampered with it. After all, many are drawn to its powers. It tempts them. How exactly are you planning to track it down? Leave that to me. Finding these artifacts has been my calling for some time now. I've developed a knack for tracking them down. With the aura gone, it should be even easier to find. Let's not waste time. What's our next move? Now that this fog is gone, I should be able to better track the artifact's location. Before that, though, I'm going to take another look around the church. See what I can learn of these foreign lands. Meet me in Topta? It'll take more than studying one church to become familiar with this island. But fine. We'll meet again soon. Okay. Night and day. Lovely. Okay, well... Let's go meet her. How close is it to where we are? Yeah, close enough. Let's go this synchronization point first.
Hold on, wait a minute. Technically. Technically, if you think about it. it like, like if you if you want to like discuss power level. Cassandra's a demigod. Eivor is straight up just a god. <laughs> Which pretty much explains that very vicious tone of tone there. Yeah. The only real difference is that in game, Eivor doesn't have some of the like like flashy abilities that Cassandra does. But I think technically they both would be able to do it. I don't know. Okay. Should be there in a second. <laughs> Took you long enough. I was beginning to think all this talk of gods and nightmares might have scared you off. I said I would come. So, great artifact hunter. Did you track it down as easily as you said you would? Not quite. But after studying this island, I found our next step. I'll lead you to it, if you're ready. On to this next step. This shared expedition is starting to feel tedious. Spoken as if finding an ancient artifact long hidden away was supposed to be simple. Nah. I take it you've been hunting these artifacts for a long time now. <laughs> yes, quite some time. What led you to this? Strangely enough, a vacation gone horribly wrong. Now it has become a destiny, of sorts. What exactly are we going to do with this artifact once we find it? I will take it far away from this island for safekeeping. To a place where no one can maliciously wield its power. Power? So it's a weapon of some kind? In the wrong hands, it is. A kind of weapon that should never be used. A weapon that shouldn't be used? That sounds like a sentiment spoken by someone too weak to wield its power. It might sound strange to you, but trust me, its power is not to be taken lightly. The survival of your world depends on that. Okay, well it sounds like the other, the, like the one that just popped up in a, Assassin's Creed Odyssey, directly leads to this, which makes sense. Or maybe not directly, directly. You know, close enough. This is it. Somehow this stone formation will bring us closer to the artifact. I think it's a riddle of some kind. Well, of course it is. Since you're clearly an expert at playing with rocks, get to solving it then. Sure. Okay. An expert at playing with rocks. <laughs> one specifically glowing. And it 
looks like it might be a map. So it looks... Come on, people. I feel like I'm getting closer. Controller's vibrations are getting stronger. something to do with this. Wait a minute. Okay, so it's these two, maybe. Yeah, I know it's that. Major Vidari, this doesn't feel quite right, but I sense I'm getting closer to uncovering what secrets these stones are hiding. Can I get up higher? So it's not exactly that. Check out the camp. Is there something other notes here? I feel the connection with the stones. When well, my feet are above the ground, I need to find a way to climb up higher. Forces work here. Yep. 
That's it? There's nothing. Ah, oh, of course you don't see it. You don't have my gifted sight. Not that the same gift kind. wouldn't run in the family, would it? Who might your parents be? Mind yourself and focus. Ooh. Really squabbling there. It looks like the Isle of Skye, but there are several markings on it. <gasps> could it? No, it couldn't be... a map? I didn't feel the need to state the obvious. So, what are the markings? There are several triangles and one X not too far from here. What are we waiting for? X marks the spot. Okay, following Cassandra. So, do you just spend your days attacking strange women in graveyards, or do you have other duties? I take care of my people. We have a settlement, Ravensthorpe. That must be nice. I've traveled alone for what feels like a lifetime now. You speak as if. How old are you exactly? <laughs> Older than you think. But everyone tells me I have a young face. <laughs> yeah, a few hundred years. That's a very pretty bird flying above you. Her name is Sunan. I had a bird once. A long time ago. An eagle named Icaros. I prefer ravens. Eagles, sir, too. Godly? Gaudy. <laughs> I mean, if you know anything, ravens are also associated with gods, so it doesn't really, uh, doesn't matter on that point. It's just pig, it's just bored of Thought we were about to get ambushed by a group of bandits or something. Yeah. Oh, that must... Okay. That glow means they're being affected by a piece of evil. You're I quiet. Not thinking of throwing another axe at my head, are you? No, I'm just not compelled to fill silence like you are. Good. That fight took a lot out of me. Not sure I'm ready for a second. You kept <laughs> me on my toes as well. Was that a compliment? It was not prideful. Cave of gold, hello. Here, stand right here. Why? <sighs> Can't you trust me? Or at least pretend to, so this goes faster? <sighs> Fine. <sighs> How did you know? Lots of practice. Another ambush! They must be drawn to the temple. They're very persistent.
I've seen this before. We'll need shards, keys, to place on this pedestal. That should open... No. We need to talk. Those people that attacked us, were they speaking your language? I already told you. The artifact has made them go mad. Cassandra! Eivor, when are you going to see that I'm here to help? Fine. We've come this far together. I trust you have good intentions. Thank you. And if you say you're not hiding anything, I believe you. There's a chance that my arrival on the Isle of Skye might be what activated the artifact's powers. But it's not certain. And even if it's true, that's all the more reason for me to remove it. No! That's all the more reason for you to leave, so I can remove it myself. You've done enough! I can't trust you, Cassandra. You have no idea what you'd be dealing with! You need my help! I know what I must do from here. And if those men are after you, it'll be even easier for me to continue by myself. Eivor, please! The powers of this artifact are unlike anything you've seen! <laughs> Nothing is too powerful for me. Besides, I'm sure I'll make better use of this weapon than you. Gah, fine! I've had enough of you anyway. You're impossible! You're too brash, Eivor! And it will undo you! I still need to find all the shots before I can open the door. Better get going. Okay! Let's get look. Oh my god. Alright. Well. Let's see. We will, uh. Work on finding the rest of the shards when we return, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed and you're on YouTube, please like, comment, subscribe. On Twitch, drop me a follow if you haven't already. And I will see you all next time.